Yo, welcome back to the channel. Uh, I think it's been like a, what, a week or so uh, that I haven't uploaded for, so apologies for that. Um, today's video is all about uh, the new gym that I've been cracking on about too. If you know me and you've seen me on Instagram, whatever, uh, I'll drop the link right here. Literally, I have not stopped going on about this new gym. So wh where I live currently, you'll see like from the intro, is literally in the middle of nowhere. So for me to find a gym that's close and I can actually make content in is unbelievable. So that's opening at 9 a.m. today. Uh, but before I can do any of that, I've got a real long run to go on. I think it's gonna be the longest run um, that I've done all prep for this 70.3. Um, with that 70.3, the last few weeks, have, they've, been, they've been challenging. Um, but yeah, I think we're at, I'm, I'm starting to come through that now. The lighter mornings are coming in. Uh, it's just giving me more time. I was on the bike at half ten at night the other day. Um, that is literally just showing that I have the discipline to do it. If I don't do it, it's not going to get done. And when it comes to the bike, that's going to be my hardest point anyway. I need to make sure that I'm putting the effort in on that as well. Um, the swim, I'm happy with how my swimming is actually coming on. And I'm starting to actually get a benefit from that as well when it comes into my running my breathing's a lot better um, as soon as my bike improves i'll find the cadence in my legs is a lot better as well then it's going to mean i'm able to push harder uh, for longer which should mean i'm going to get faster as well as well as training my aerobic base too um next week on the 4th of march so if this video is out before then i hopefully fingers crossed it will be um hybrid hub is launching as well so that is like a whole new program platform uh, either for bespoke and normal programs so if you're looking to like get into shape get into that hybrid kind of style run lift conditioning perfect for you and if you want it all to yourself then the bespoke coaching is perfect as well but yeah let's go get some food you've seen my morning supplements and my electrolyte drink this morning all from ghost and i will catch you downstairs Yo, so long slow run um, this morning. I ran the other day and it was a 90 minute run. This is a 120 minute run. And I did, what did I do last night? It was like 16.9 uh, K in total in 90 minutes uh, at a slow pace, like zone two, zone three, like the whole time, not pushing anything at all. So today it's 123, 123 minutes, so to speak. So I'm guessing it's gonna be about what? 17, 18 K complete, so be the furthest I've ever ran this whole time but yeah the views this morning are unbelievable look at this so I'll catch you when I'm probably like three or four K in let's go That was the slippiest part of the road I've ever run on. Trying to get down there, so this is all downhill. Probably wasn't the, <laughs> the best idea to come here when it's this, uh, this frosty in the morning, but hopefully it'll thaw out as we've got quite a while to go. But oh, I'm literally stepping and sliding like nuts here. But yeah, two K in, let's go. Don't mind running when your views are like that. One bit. That isn't real. Oh my god. So I think I got that wrong in when I looked at my calendar. It was actually threshold. So started off 25 minutes in zone two. Uh, then it was 20 minutes, 171 and 177 BPM. So that's near it's like high zone three, low zone four, I think. I think. Um, and then from there, moving into um, little threshold parts. So then it was five minutes back in zone two, then 10 minutes between 171 and 177 again. Then it was three minutes on, 30 seconds off. So the three minutes on was 177 BPM, 30 seconds in zone two, at like 152, back onto three. That makes sense. That's a lot of numbers. I do apologize. Um, but yeah, and then just to finish off the cool down, just I'm just walking home now, but. That was absolutely solid. So the nice run I thought it was going to be. Doing on the scenes were mad and the views were mad in the video, hopefully, that you've just seen. Um, but yeah, overall, tough session. But God, the runner's high right now is hitting hard. It's uh, it's always good. And with the new gym opening, which I'm going to go to in a minute as well. Get some food in. Oh, get some food in and I'll catch you soon. 
So it's not all just running and gym. Uh, oh God, I slipped over there. Also have a few chores, so I need to feed the chickens now before we can go to the gym. Get a meal in, which I'll show you from prep pots. They've been really, really helpful actually. Um, since having that, I might, my food bill is a hell of a lot less because I'm not having to spend so much money on food. And it's, and it's so like ready for you whenever you need it as well. When I actually do a day in the life of eating, you'll see that I normally have about four eggs a day. So that's what, like, I don't even know, like what, six, seven, eight quid a week in, in, um, in eggs. So we just thought if we get some chickens, overall it'd be cheaper. So just had my pre-gym food, um, so from Pet Pots, uh, a burrito and a fajita chicken. Um, although I do definitely recommend the satay chicken more. I uh, had that yesterday, it was not real. Um, Recently, I've been trying this new pre-workout from Ghost, along with a pump as well. Definitely mixing these two together is unreal. That's like a natural flavour, so it doesn't taste or anything. Uh, and this is grape, so yeah. Definitely trying them, uh, obviously with it all in the shaker. So all before gym. Uh, obviously can't have any of this caffeinated stuff uh, before my 70.3 event uh, in the swim and the cycle but in term, and the run. But in terms of gym, it's absolutely perfect for that. Uh, but yeah, looking forward to this. It's a brand new gym, just opened literally today. Hopefully it's not going to be too busy. I say it's, it's been open a few hours now, so hopefully it will have died down. So I'll catch you at the gym. Also just made it to the gym now. Um, it looks sick. Give me, give me a shot, give me a shot. So yeah, let's go have a sick session. What a waste of love. So that is session complete. Um, overall, that gym is sick. So happy uh, that it's my actual local gym, considering I'd have to travel like 40, 50 minutes away normally for like JD, Gymshark, etc. Um, I'll obviously still go over to Gymshark and stuff, but in terms of being able to have that on the doorstep after swimming and all that kind of stuff as well, is absolutely spot on. But there, that is a day in the life of what I'm getting up to at the moment. Uh, what I eat in a day is gonna be on the channel really, really soon. But if you enjoyed this video, please remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Let's go.